obviously FA Trophy action um, this weekend. Uh, if you look at the league form, it's it's not amazing, is it? Our last win obviously came in the trophy against Dorkin, so it, it, you know we're we're really going to want to turn that around on Saturday, aren't we? Yeah, I think I think we can we can say the cliche thing where performances um, at Wrexham was was where we wanted to be, but we can't we can't make excuses in our league um, results and the, and the points on the board haven't been good enough, and we're we're, we're fully aware of that. So um, this is almost coming at a good time where we can. Um, Look to have a positive result and, and, and try hopefully turn that momentum and and Torquay was kind of a stepping t- stone towards that. I, n- I know we, the quality wasn't there and we, and we lacked that that final edge, but we did create some chances where we could have gone and won the game. I mean, it was a diff- difficult scenario to be in, obviously with where they are, but we know what we need to do. We know we need to to be aggressive and be front foot um, and put a performance on to to get points on the board. But again, as you said, we start Saturday and and hopefully do something that that hasn't been done at this club and, and, and take a step again further closer to Wembley. I think you say about you know wanting to be aggressive and that I, I guess a real um, you know example of that is when we played Halifax last time obviously winning 5-1 in front of the BT cameras so have you have you said anything about that result and you know more of the same? Yeah I think that that's the way we want to play we, we have to be aggressive we have to put it be on the front foot we've got attacking players and we've got talent to be able to go and do so so There'll be no change there. We'll, we'll want to go and attack this game and, and take them on and, and, and be aggressive. And But again, you look at their form, they're coming off a, a 5 0 win against Wellstone and, and, and two clean sheets, so it's going to be tough. They're, they're resolute in, in how they play, and, and we've just got to be on our ball and, and be aggressive in front foot because that's what the fans want to see. And, and if we do so and get our attacking players on the ball, um, fingers crossed it will go, the result will go the way we want. One of those attacking players is, of course. Tavon Campbell, who we saw, you know, his first ninety minutes on Saturday. Have you been pleased with what you've seen from him so far? Yeah, we have been. He, he's been a great addition, not only um, with his quality and, and 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 composure in front of goal, but he's a leader and he's an older character in the dressing room, which is something we've lacked. So, um, yeah, he's he's been a great addition, and, and hopefully, fingers crossed, we can see uh, and get the best out of him certainly for Saturday and, and moving forward towards the end of the season. On Tuesday, we had the Hampshire Cup. Obviously, it was a first-team fixture, but a lot of the lads playing were from the academy side of things, which, you know, you won't be a stranger to most of those lads. So how did you rate that performance? It was a good result, wasn't it? Yeah, and it was a good watch. I think I think they, they looked to dominate the ball and they looked to be front-footed. And it was a good, good opportunity to see um, see them at the EBB on, on, on a bigger surface and, 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 and kind of under the lights. And, and we, we know the quality that the 23s have got. Rich, obviously... Uh, managing that team system himself and Ross has come up he, he's a great coach so no, no strangers with the way that he's got them playing and, and obviously Tommy went and stepped in and done really well so it's it's a good opportunity for them in the Hampshire Cup to, to get involved in the first team set up but also give the opportunity for players that need minutes to be able to um, increase their match sharpness and so far this season we've seen people like Ben Lacey Turner you know been around it Alex McAllister we've seen Mason Obeng around the first team picture and at training and stuff so there is a pathway for those lads isn't it yeah, a hundred percent. That's that's what we want to do. We're, we're going to have to build um, that base of of academy players where where we can get players into the first team. And uh, Keno and Macca are, are Kingstonian doing fantastic for them in, in kind of the revival the new manager's done there. Um, Maxi as well. He, he's progressing nicely. He took a little bit of an injury, but again, hopefully he'll be on the pitch soon. And and yeah, Mason Mason's a great talent. So the more um, talent we can get through and, and, and bring up to the first team, the better for us. Cheers, James. Thanks, Sam. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.